welcome back to my channel or hello if you are new here my name is Kayla Ray and I post weekly videos related to lifestyle motivation and motherhood today's video is a pantry organization if you haven't seen my new house tour I will post that in the cards above and you can see how our um, how we moved into our house what it looks like and the pantry is pretty dated so and it's big so I just had to figure out how I was going to organize it um, so I went to Dollar Tree and I got a couple baskets and Hobby Lobby and then I used some other things that I had around so stay tuned to see um, how I organize and make over my pantry if you don't already follow me um, on Instagram head over there to Kayla Ray Nelson because I post on my stories every day and subscribe to this channel if you like videos like this and want to see more hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I post new videos all right let's get into the pantry makeover are about to go into Dollar Tree. I'm gonna see what they have as far as pantry organization because my pantry is like cluttered and messy and I don't even know where to put anything. So I'm hoping I can find some good stuff um, in the Dollar Tree and then I can share with you guys how I'm going to put it all together. So let's go see what they have. Summer stuff. So these look like they might be good. I'm a toy. I'm a toy, Mama. I got a toy. I got a toy. I got a toy. These might be good. We're gonna get you a toy. Maybe these for the bottom. Put snacks in. Be good. They're small things. A couple more of these. Okay, so back from the Dollar Tree, and this is what I got. These I actually got at um, Walmart a few days ago. Okay. okay, we're gonna go outside. These I got from Walmart um, to put cereal in and stuff. I got, I don't know if I'm gonna use all of this, but I've got these baskets. Yes, Harper. These baskets, and then I got these to label. So I'm gonna work on that. Oh, okay. I'm gonna work on that when he goes to bed because uh, clearly I'm not getting that done now, so. All right. What? So I'm starting off this pantry organization by just taking everything out, laying on the floor, and putting it in some type of organizational pile just so that I have some way of thinking how I'm gonna put it all back. So I'm clearing it all out and deciding what's even gonna stay in there and what I'm going to put in another spot. <music>
off. I've left some appliances and like pots in the bottom. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and sort everything that's on the ground so I can get started with figuring out how many baskets I'm going to need and where I'm going to put everything. jarred items in one section, baking items in a basket, and as I'm going through this I'm realizing that I just want to keep it this small. I don't want to buy more than I actually need because that's when pantries just get overwhelmingly cluttered and that's what used to happen to me where I had so many things in my pantry that I didn't even use. Half of it went expired. So I want to try and really keep it to what I need and keep a few staple items that I know I'm going to use that way. I don't get overwhelmed and have like a huge, messy, overloaded pantry. Um, we know what we have, let's hold on tight. Found what we're looking for in life. Call us crazy, but things are finally right. So I've organized it all. I've got canned goods and jarred items, pasta, sauces, coffee, tea, breakfast items. I've got some protein bars and I'm moving that over with the pasta. I just decided mac and cheese and noodles. That's going to be one thing. Um, chips, kids snacks, crackers, and spices. You and I can weather any storm before I sleep. Hear the crickets, see the moon Side by side and through and through No limit to I had to kind of play around with the bins because I didn't know if I would have enough room and then I had to imagine like when I grab another bag of chips at the store will I have room? Um, these were the containers I was going to use for the canned goods but you'll see later on in the video what I actually use because I switched around so you know play with it, move things around, see what makes sense and what fits right. That's what I did and I changed it a couple times and you'll see as we go through um, that I changed some of the baskets and I even went to the store to get a couple extra things. Um, I have obviously way too many club crackers right now but I love some wine with cheese and crackers so I always have club crackers on hand. And then I decided to put the nuts and the um, crackers and popcorn in one basket.
sauces in these little containers. Realistically, I know I'm gonna have a lot more sauces. Like this is a basic pantry because I just moved in. Um, I didn't do like a humongous grocery haul. So I'm missing a lot of things. So later on, I switch it out because I know that I'm gonna get more vinegars and sauces and salad dressings. having their sandwiches and cucumbers or whatever it is shaped into fun shapes. So I'm putting all of the cookie cutters in here. Um, I couldn't fit them all in there so I put some in a bag and then I just decided after the fact that I'm going to separate the Christmas ones separately that way I have more room because I really don't need the Christmas ones in there all year long. chalkboard clips from the Dollar Tree and it came with a marker for it so I went ahead and started labeling how I wanted to organize the baskets and containers and when I'm looking back at it now I wish that the labels were a little bit bigger or that they were all the same but you know I did this quickly on a budget and the labels don't really matter in the long run everything's labeled pretty well I think and these were really cute labels I went by your house, what a big mistake But for a while I thought that I wouldn't break Ooh. I need something else to clear my head Someone to tell me how to live instead Just open your eyes and take my advice Stop rolling the dice and just compromise It's the chance of your life overwhelming at first because I just did not know how I was going to organize everything so I decided to start putting things on the shelf looking at it deciding if I need to switch things around and go from there okay, try to be brave. You have so much to save. take control of
2 a.m. in the car playing our favorite song. Turn it up, windows down, we sing along. The summer night has just begun. The moon is bright, let's have some fun. Sick in the morning, baby, don't leave. They don't need to know we're out here, wild and free. They say we're crazy, it's too much. So it's slowly starting to come together. I'm having an issue thinking about what to do with the breakfast items. I feel like I might need to go get a bigger basket later on, but I decide to put them up there anyways. The spices container is gonna go. That was like an old container that I used for kids crafts and I used it just for now so I can kind of look and see what I liked. So you'll see later on what I use for that. I don't wanna go. This is everything with you right next to me. So alive, and tonight I'm thinking that I don't wanna go. This is everything with you right next to me. So alive, and tonight I'm thinking that I don't wanna go. on um, I'm just taping them to the container we'll see how long that lasts if I need to um, get a different type of string to tie it around I'll do that but this is gonna work for now I really love how big these labels are and I wish that I got more like this but um, the Dollar Tree did have tons of these what I was going to do and what 
baskets I was going to keep and you'll see right up next how I decided to switch it around. So after looking at, this is the next day by the way, after looking at the closet in the pantry, I was just feeling like I just needed more space. Like if you look down here, I'm going to get more like potatoes and stuff and I didn't want to run out of space. And I also feel like this, all these spaces are wasted space. So I grabbed a couple larger baskets from Hobby Lobby. They were 50% off. So this is what they look like. They're bigger. I'm going to use the white ones and put the blue ones in the playroom. So I'm going to switch on some of the baskets and then see how it looks. Because, I mean, I know it's not going to look super perfect Pinteresty because I'm using what I have, Dollar Tree and Hobby Lobby. So let's see if I can get this looking a little bit better. So I initially liked having them in smaller um, baskets, but I think I'm gonna put the cans in this. Um, I don't really like how you can see through it. That's where I'm at on this. I actually might use these for um, like arts and crafts or something. So I'm gonna take these out because I just decided I don't like them. That I gotta decide hmm, what I'm going to do. Still doesn't look great to me. Um, I do have one more basket that I got. This tall basket. I'm wondering if this would be good somewhere, but then it's its own basket. Okay, let me try to do some configuration here and see what I could do. Okay, this looks so much better to me um, so I don't know what I'm gonna do about the breakfast thing but right now I've got cereal pancake mix oats and then little mini cereals in here um, noodles which includes like mac and cheese pasta noodles um, I've got protein bars and like drink mixes over here I labeled that maybe I'll put that one I mean at least that you see one label um, dressings and sauces in here baking stuff in here all my canned goods and i think i'll be able to fit a good amount in there canned goods um spices are in here coffee and tea potatoes rice couscous all that kind of stuff um nut butters and miscellaneous stuff crackers nuts popcorn and then chips and then extra like pretzels and stuff over there. So here it is, all completed. I really want to eventually paint these shelves or put liners on them, so that will be, I guess, my next pantry makeover, but here it is for now.
All right guys, that is my pantry organization and makeover. I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, please give it a like and comment below if you did enjoy it or give me some of your pantry organization tips. Um, and also subscribe if you haven't already done so. I would love to have you here on my channel so you can see more videos like this. I'm gonna do an office makeover, kids room tours. I mean a whole house tour once I get this whole house set up. Right now I'm in the playroom so I will share our so I will share um, the kids' playroom and how I organized and set that up. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you next time. Bye. So if you are new here, my name is Kayla Ray and I post weekly videos related to